A few days ago, I was looking at pictures on my phone and I came across some from two years ago when my daughter had just been born. Even though the pictures were only a couple of years old, it was hard to believe how different my kids looked. In just two years, they've grown and changed so much. Do you ever look back at baby pictures of yourself? Maybe your parents have pictures or videos on their phone of when you were really little. It can be pretty crazy to look back and see what you looked like back then, can't it? It can be hard to believe that's really you. In just two or five or ten years, we change a lot. That's how life is. We're used to the fact that people and places change. When it comes to the Trinity, the fact that God is one God in three persons, we can think that maybe God started as one person, and then things happened and he became two persons, and then three persons. Like, maybe Jesus wasn't the Son of God until he came and was born at the first Christmas. But that's not true. God has always been a trinity. In John 17, 24, Jesus says, Father, I will that they also, whom thou hast given me, be with me where I am, that they may behold my glory, which thou hast given me. For thou lovest me before the foundation of the world. That means that before the world was created, the Father and the Son were one God, but separate persons. God has been a trinity since before he created the world. When God created the world, all three persons of the trinity were there, and each of them had important jobs in making the world. We can know that God has always been a trinity because God never changes. That's what we're learning about in Kids for Truth this week. These are big and wonderful truths for us to learn about together.